Computer simulated metal stamping analysis has evolved over the years to help engineers predict the initial blank shape that results in a high quality final deformed shape. These nonlinear simulations have become commonplace during the design phase to save time and cost. By coupling the stamping simulation with a standalone optimization program, the initial blank can be sized to reduce material waste, but due to the long computation time required by each simulation, typically fewer than 10 designable parameters can be considered. In contrast, the Genesis Linear Structural Optimization Program, which tightly couples design optimization with linear finite element analysis, is routinely being used to solve large-scale problems with over 100,000 designable parameters. The Equivalent Static Loads, or ESL, method takes advantage of the ability of the Genesis Linear Structural Optimization Program to solve large-scale optimization problems while using the responses from a nonlinear finite element analysis, such as a stamping simulation. Design Studio for Genesis is used here to illustrate the designable metal blank structure in green. The design objective for this problem is to modify the geometry of the initial blank so that once it is deformed, the outer curved edge is as close as possible to the target values shown in red. The ESL method is found in Design Studio under the Plugins tab. Locations of the executables for Genesis and LSDyna are set by the user as well as the path to the Dyna input files. Once the ESL problem is set up, it is run within Design Studio. When the optimization has finished, the blank shape results may be visualized in Design Studio by selecting the Post tab. In Design Studio, we may compare the original undeformed blank at Design Cycle 0 with the optimized undeformed blank at Design Cycle 19. The optimized shape shows a reduction in material. This particular example took 5 LS Dyna simulations and 19 Genesis Design Cycles to complete. The LS Dyna simulations averaged 20 seconds each, while the Genesis design iterations averaged 3 seconds each. The computer platform used was an HP XW4600 workstation running Windows Vista 64-bit with 8 gigabytes of RAM. Vanderplatt's research and development has implemented the ESL method to seamlessly perform optimization based on an LS Dyna nonlinear analysis with Genesis as a structural optimization program. All the different types of design optimization techniques in Genesis are available in the engineer's arsenal to design structures with this coupling method. LS Dyna is a product of the Livermore Software Technology Corporation, while Genesis and Design Studio are products of Vanderplatt's Research and Development, Inc. This video showed the shape improvement of an initial blank based on how well the deformed blank matched the desired target shape. For more information on this or any of Vanderplatt's R&D software products, please visit our website at www.vrand.com or send email to info at vrand.com.